Today's video is going to show you exactly the steps you need to take to build your own money plays in Madden 18. What's up guys, my name is Cody and in today's video we are trying to help you guys get some strategies and templates together for Madden 18 and one of the things that I thought would be helpful is to teach you how to make your own money plays uh, or what I would call a power play. And uh, what you want to do is you just want to kind of look through your, your playbook. And what I like to do, I've already talked about this a little bit, is having a, a preset plan for practice. So I know when I go into practice mode, I want to work on this play against this specific defense, against this, be as specific as possible. But for the sake of this video, what I want to do is just kind of give you uh, a couple of principles. So the first tip to creating your own money player, the first step is to pick a playbook that you want to utilize. For me, it's the Arizona Card Cardinals playbook, and I want to work out of the tight flex just because it's a, a cool formation, really. There's no other reason. Uh, so then you open up your formation, and the second step is to find what I call a, a unique route. Uh, so you want to try to look at, for a route that you think would be helpful or useful to use. Um, so here, as we see, uh, looks like this formation actually does it have has a couple of different things, but I don't really yeah, – I'm, I'm going to change my mind on this. I'm going to get out of that. Um, let's let's do something else. So let's see here. Let's mess around with the flip. Let's let's mess around with flip flip. Uh, excuse me, flip trips. Let's see what we have here. So so flip trips and the play I want to work with today is the deep fork. And the reason I want to work with the deep fork is because I think there's a lot of unique power routes in it. Um, but you, that's just, step two is to pick your play. So whatever play it is that you want to work with. You know, just try it out. So I'm going to work with the, the, the flip trip. So I'm going to go ahead and flip it just because it reminds me of the shotgun bunch weak, the way that this play is going to work. So we're going to flip the formation. Now, defense, uh, what you want to do is, is you want to work against whatever coverage you want to work against. Uh, what I would do is uh, just call random plays, uh, and it's going to get you used to different things. Uh, if you if you wanted to, you could bring two controllers in, in my opinion. Um, you know, I just like going against random plays just because you never know what the defense is going to call. So here, the first thing you want to do is you want to snap the snap the ball and just and just run the play as is, and you're going to take a sack. So it looks like here they went into man coverage. So now what I want to do is I want to go into the instant replay. And what instant replay is going to do is it's going to show me how effective my routes are. So the first route I'm going to look at is this motion snapped out route. As you see, that got open. Second thing is the running back. As you see, the running back's wide open. Third thing is the C route. As you see, that's open against man. And then the fourth and fifth routes, the post and corner on the left side, they didn't really get open at all. Okay, so then what you're going to do is uh, do it again. And now here they're showing cover three, but it looks like they're in man coverage. So then we're just kind of mess around and start throwing the ball to different routes against different uh, coverages, whether it's man zone. So here showing cover two man again, and we'll see here goes to goes to man coverage. I want to see if I can hit that C route, and I am able to do it. So here showing uh, cover four, and then you just kind of go and go and go and go. So here we want to test this corner route again. It just looks like a standard corner route, so so you know that that's not going to work. Um, but the cool part about this is you can do different things with Des Bryant. You can put, if you wanted to, you can put him on an in route and motion it in, and now he's going to run an in, an in route instead of an out route. And you can do different things like that to, to change up the play. Okay. But the key is you want to you, you really just want to test out these unique different plays that you have in your playbook, and then you want to try try the different throwing lanes against different defenses. And you, it'll take it'll take a little I would say it probably takes me about five minutes to make an offensive play. Um, you want to try to figure out you know can I use or catch? Can I do different things like that? Uh, one other thing I like to do is just you know mess around with what will happen is the defense will become accustomed to Des Bryant motion 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 motion. All of a sudden, now he's on just a quick out route. You know, what does that look like? And you just test it and test it and test it and test it. It's so like here's a goal line defense. So this is a good little test if we can hit this quick pass. As you can see, we're able to hit it against man-to-man. -man. Now that's a tool we can use in the game. So now we know, okay, so now my first progression is going to be Zeke Elliott out of the backfield on this quick throw. I really like that route. All I have to do with the snap of the ball is, is uh, tap left trigger. So I tap left trigger. It sets my quarterback up, and then I bullet pass it to Zeke. And as you can see, that snap throw works really well. And then what I do from there is look to my next read, which is this out route to Des Bryant. And you just, and again, you just kind of go through these progressions, check the reads out, check the check the potential out in this. So I know, okay, look look right, look left. And then where do I look? Well, I look to the C route. As you can see here, the C route, very powerful route. 
this season in Madden uh, 17. I imagine it will be just as powerful, if not more powerful, in Madden 18. And then I want to look to the corner route there. Dak Prescott just overthrew the ball. But again, you just keep working, keep tinkering. And what will happen, guys, is the more you do this and the more consistent you do it and the more you'll, you'll, the more you'll learn what to look for. What I like to look for is a post route or a corner route of some type. So, uh, for example, slot trail has a corner, so I think it could be a good motion play. Um, let's see if I can find something else. So PA wide receiver in. Here's another some, uh, something that has potential to be a money play because you have two things. You have a wheel route and you have a uh, kind of Z spot style post route, which they said they're going to take that out of the gun bunch. Again, what I'm going to encourage everybody to understand is just because they're going to take it out of the shotgun bunch does not mean that they're going to take it out of the game. And it does not mean that the shotgun bunch is not going to be effective. I truly believe the shotgun bunch will still be the best formation in Madden 18 because it's just a good formation. It's not just because of Z spot. It's because of everything you can do off of it. Um, but as you see here, this user catch just works just fine. So, again, and you want to just kind of tinker with it, kind of mess around with it. But the core concept first is you want to you look at your playbook first. And you want to just kind of try to simplify your focus on one formation. And once you get in the formation, try one play. And then once you get one play, once you kind of have those things, then what you want to do is master your reads. What makes a money play a money play is is the fact that your reads are so good and so systematic that it's easy to execute. Okay, so as you guys go into Madden 18, I just want to encourage you guys, to remind you guys, when you're building your offense, when you're building what, what, I, what I would call a money play, you want to look for a couple things. Number one, you want to look for a formation that normally will have three wide receivers, one tight end, and one running back. Those are where I find the best plays. Number two, you want to focus on one formation, not several. One play, okay? And then the third, the, the fourth thing, which is important, is, is you want to test it in practice mode. And you want to see, does it beat man here? Does it beat zone? What are the progressions if they do this? How are they going to stop this? So that's one thing that's important. So if you, you need to kind of start to brainstorm, what are things that they're going to do to stop it? So like on this play, what they'll probably do is they'll probably try to use or cover the running back out of the backfield. Do I have something set up for when they do that? And so for me, um, if they're going to use, say, imagine they use or cover that running back, well, now I got this route to Des Bryant. And then if they play down on the route to Des Bryant, then I get the corner around on the back end. So as you see, it, it takes it, let you take it depth, you take it with different levels. And what happens is as you're building your play, you think through what are the things that the defense can do to stop you. And what this will ultimately do is it will lead you to the fact that they're going to eventually be able to stop this with several different hot routes. What will happen in, what will happen after that though, is that it will leave certain areas open. And that's where we put in our secondary play which is what I call a counterplay that can help you take advantage of those types of vulnerabilities the defense will have if they stop your money play. Okay, so anyways, guys, this has been how to create a money play in Madden 18. I truly look forward to seeing your guys' different plays. And real quick, I want to encourage all of you watching this video, if you have a money play that you would like to share, um, I will post a video on my channel with your money play. So if you if you have a money play and you want to record a video and send it to me, uh, my email is in the description. Just shoot me an email and we can go from there. But I do look forward to seeing your guys' money plays, testing out your guys' stuff, and helping the community get better at Madden because that's what we're all about here at the channel. If this is your first time at my channel, I'm happy that you guys stumbled upon and I hope the video was helpful. Be sure to subscribe. That way you can get more Madden 18 content for free.